just one red bag. To be fair, there's not a lot in it, is there? Um, <laughs> well, we say I was faster today. Uh, well, yesterday, and, and I'll be faster today, as long as you don't play me off. Because we also, uh, you guys have got a circuit map on the table, and we kind of get the guys to talk you around the circuit. I mean, do you know anything about Josh? You don't okay? Do you want to just say we are start finish yep. line, we come across yeah. where? Fourth, fifth, sixth gear, or where are we then? Sixth gear. And then uh, into Old Hall, which is Carry On, right? Yeah, it's the first corner. Uh, probably one of the quickest corners on the track. Uh, you just a little break down to fifth gear, uh, turning back to full throttle pretty quickly. Um, and then you head down towards Cascades, uh, which was where Dave was really, really quick yesterday. Um, yeah, we're inside. Now we know the corner. Yeah, right, yeah, yeah, so through Cascades is where Dave was quick. Um, and then you head down, you know, flat back up to sixth gear again, into the uh, into the hairpin. There's a bit of a bump just on the braking zone, which makes things difficult, but you're all the way down to second gear, so it's a really, really heavy braking zone. Um, and then I'll pass you on to Dave and we'll put you through the next bit. Um, is this your cane? <laughs> I've never heard of that. Um, but yeah, we're breaking down, it's downhill breaking to there, so um, it's very hard on the brakes down into there. Um, and there's some pretty big curves, you can get really airborne on the curves uh, if, you, if you, that's not the quickest way by the way. Um, it's just, it's fairly technical through the, through the chicane there, and then you're up the hill to the fastest part of the circuit actually, which surprised me, is into Druid's, uh, it's uphill and you, it's not even a straight, but it's the fastest part of the circuit. Druid's is a really good corner, it's, I'd say that's the fastest, fastest, part of the, <laughs> fastest corner on the track. Um, it's like a double apex corner and there's a jump on the exit of it which uh, th throws the car sideways so that's quite exciting and then we're into Lodge um, down to third gear quite technical again and it's really important to get a good drive off there to finish the lap um, great circuit but I'd say it's Monaco of, uh, of, of BTCC this it's, uh, it's not easy to overtake it's very it's quite narrow and it's a flowing track so um, there's no real big stoppies to do somebody on the break, so um got some questions over here already. Okay. <laughs> um so yeah and that's that's completing the lap of Vulcan Five. Great circuit, but I think it's gonna be a hard day today from uh, from where we are on the grid but um we've got race two um where it, it's that's dictated by this the uh, the lap time of race one. So if we get a good lap time in we could get towards the front but uh, and we're on the spot. I think we're both on the softs for race one so that should be that should be good. That should give us a decent lap time and then we just hold on to the tyre and make sure it lasts to the end of the race. Yeah, I think it's fair to say Alton Park's 